Hey guys, I'm your host, Alex Saunders, and today we'll be talking about my overall grade of the first round of the Miami Dolphins NFL Draft. Let's hop into the video. Picked number five overall is Tua. In my opinion, Tua is the best quarterback in this draft class if he didn't have his hip injured at the end of his senior season. Because in his senior season, only playing nine games, he threw 33 touchdowns, three interceptions, and 2,840 passing yards. Overall, the only major concern I have with Tua is his injury history. Obviously, lots of surgeries, lots of ankle, wrists, hip injuries. Scary because he could end up like RG3 is someone who I can put into that you know, category of who could have had a great career, but injuries slowed him down. Dolphins are setting Tua up in a great position. Also drafting Austin Jackson 18th overall. And then also having the weapons that he has between Devontae Parker, Albert Wilson, Mike Gazeki, Jordan Howard, many options that Tua has to throw to. Overall, I grade this an A minus. The only reason it's not an A and it's an A minus is because of the injury concerns. But overall, this was a cannot pass up move for the Miami Dolphins. Picked at number 18 for the Miami Dolphins, we have Austin Jackson, left tackle out of USC. Jackson is a very skilled and athletic tackle for his frame. Overall, he's going to be a major, major improvement over our past left tackle last season. Jackson will be able to help protect Tua, whether he's playing left or right tackle at the beginning of the season. Jackson is a great upgrade to this offense line and a great addition. Overall, I give this grade a B plus only because I think they might, they probably should have traded up for Wharfs. Or they should have drafted a safety with this pick, which would have been, in my opinion, the better options. The Miami Dolphins then traded away the 26th overall pick to the Green Bay Packers in exchange for the 30th and 138th pick in the 2020 NFL Draft. Miami Dolphins drafted Noah, I do not want to butcher his name, I'm sorry, cornerback out of Auburn with the 30th overall pick. Overall, I didn't think cornerback was a need that they needed to fill in the first round of the draft, but most likely play cornerback number three for the Miami Dolphins. Overall, I don't think this was a terrible pickup, but I think they could have looked at other places to fill much before they filled cornerback number three. He had seven passes defended, 42 tackles, and even one tackle for a loss in his senior season. A fun fact about him is that he played receiver for his first two seasons at Auburn, and then switched over to cornerback where he began to flourish as a corner. Overall, again, I think they could have focused on other positions. So I gave this grade a B only because I think they should have focused at safety or running back with this pick. But instead, they chose to go to corner. Hope you guys liked the video. Please remember to like, subscribe, and comment down below who you think the Dolphins should have drafted. And what grade you guys gave each one of the draft picks that they did draft. Also... Down in the description below is the link to my article I just wrote on this same topic. Go give it a read. Also, right here, please remember to click this video for more daily Miami Dolphins content. Also, right here, remember to subscribe to the channel for more daily Miami Dolphins content. Peace out.